Hello, how are you doing today? I am Maya and this is my wet shaving channel, not only, but that's what it's about today. Today I'm going to be showing you another US soap and that is Sterling Varin, which is a, a mutton tallow soap. And I am using today the Yucky Lime. And look at the picture um, that I have in front of that. There you go. Look, I'm trying to bring it up as close as possible. That's the lime. It has the mink knot in, which is the softest there is, but it still has backbone. I love the scent of this varin. It's really, really lovely. And I haven't used this razor for, I don't know how long it must be, maybe even six months and that is the single edge this is the blackland vector a very underrated razor in my opinion the best single edge there is out there and it has a kai pink blade in it i can't remember how many uses but quite a few and it's not blunt at all if but your mileage may vary you might get eight or ten out of it. I get a few more. So I've wet my face. Let's get going. And once again, I had to put the lights on. I'm sorry for that, guys and girls. <laughs> it's already almost too dark, but I'm hoping that some of the light coming through the window is going to influence the video quality to the better. Oh, this feels so good. The scent is so nice. I'll put up here what the scent notes are or in the information box down below. I'm not quite sure which way around. So... This is already late afternoon and this won't be up till most probably the evening. Oh, this feels so good. Oh, get my hair out the way. <laughs> Let's tuck it in. And here. And this is the reason why I like it. It just goes under the nose. super easy it's flat has a great coverage because of the extra long single blade that's in there and the single blades are those injector blades not a sing not a half de blade like you put into the razor rock ufo that's a half de blade this one is an ejector blade and you can put in feathers are the most common ones i prefer the kai You get different kinds of feathers. I have a feather light, which I have not opened yet. But the feather professional and the feather, I can't remember what the other one was, um, are a bit too harsh for my skin type. I prefer the Kai pinks right I was today with the dogs walking in the park I try to do it once a week because it's further away And the old boy and the old girl 
sometimes can't make it, so I've got a plan in the day where they've had enough rest prior to, and where they can have their plenty of rest after, um, so that they make it. And it was really empty today, which surprises me. There weren't many people about at all. Loads of cars, so I don't know where the cars were going. Supposedly we're having lockdown. Lots of cars about. But hardly anybody in the park. Which is great for me. I don't like hordes of people anyway. But a little bit disappointing for the dogs because they like meeting people, eating and greeting people and the other dog walkers. We had a few, I think maybe about five or six. That always makes their day as well. Because I think that actually it impacts them as well, being out and not being able to say hello to everybody. You know, and sitting there, I used to sit there on a bench and just let them sometimes just mooch around, but you can't do that now. And of course, with the cold weather, Not that cold, but nippy enough and the and the drawn in days, I think it affects them as well as it affects the same as it affects us, really. So it made their day that they at least saw a few other dogs they could say hello to and had different smells. Yeah, and I enjoyed it too. It was nice and quiet. I said not so. Even though the road traffic was a lot, you couldn't hear it, which is nice. I got soap on my glasses. There we go. So otherwise, I don't know where the day has gone again. From the moment I got up to now, I've been busy, 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 busy. Ah, oh, I love this scent. Still got quite a lot left. Let me just wipe off the brush as I normally do, just to show you the knot in vivo, en vivo, as the Spanish say. Not just on the picture. Let's have a mini cleanse. So that you can see it has backbone but it's super super soft shake it out a bit there there you go this is it and it's lovely it's a synthetic obviously and this green this I I don't know this reminds me more of an apple green drink that one used to get. Most probably one can still get drinks that are as green as this. <laughs> I'm sure not very healthy. All the gummy bears, the green ones used to have this color. <laughs> All very healthy, I'm sure. <laughs> so, that was the yucky lime. I think it's called Lime Mink. It is a 24 millimeter. And I actually quite like it. When I say I actually quite like it, it's because at first I wasn't sure about it. I'm using my aloe first. Before I knock it over. Into the basin. I haven't used aloe first for a little bit either. Okay. 
Okay, now I think I'm going to use a combo actually between the aloe lotion and put some of that on. This contains lanolin. So not for the sensitive, lanolin sensitive people. But I just love, love, love how it keeps the skin. Really the hydration of the soap and the first locked into your skin. The Sterling soap soaps have pretty good post shave feel anyway. But this just gives you the extra or a bit of lock in. And now I'm going to put over the top because of the little bit of menthol, the Pro Rasso sensitive, it needs using up anyway. So I'm using a tiny bit of that. And I've already made a mess. Here we go. Uh, it's not a lot. Just for the bit of mentholated scent. Add that on top. I prefer to have the good stuff first, as in all natural stuff, and this over the top just for the scent. <sighs> I feel better now. It was going to was a quite a long day for me already, <clears throat> so that's just cheered me up. No. So much more, that's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> so, as you can guess, this week's going to be another sterling week. And I must say, I'll just show you, this is the, the sample. And I've used quite a bit out of it already. And I think out of the tallow soaps, this one is my absolute favourite because you can still get it. The other one is the Porto Prince, which you cannot get anymore, and the um, and the Scots Pine Sheep. Hmm. No, not so good. But this one is absolutely fabulous. So that's a definitely a keeper. I hope you have enjoyed yourself today. I enjoyed the little bit of time with me, and I will see you. What's today? Tuesday. On. Thursday. See you Thursday. Fingers crossed. <laughs> Fingers crossed it is Thursday as planned. If not, then it will be Friday. So, loving you and leaving you. Already missing you. See you soon. Bye bye.